The greatest quality in a man is wisdom, and the wise man has the strength of character to doubt even his most passionately held beliefs. This video hopes to reach the wise. The Quran wrongly claims the moon split in two recently, which is a false, unscientific claim, as shown by the complete absence of articles supporting it in scientific publications. Verse 54 1 states, The hour has drawn near, and the moon was split in two. Yet whenever they see a sign, they turn away, saying, Same old magic. They are the kafir, or unbelievers. Further evidence is the hadith, which is the accepted teachings of Muhammad, which claims, in around 620 AD, the following happened. Muhammad was challenged by unbelievers to prove he was a prophet by showing a miracle, so he supposedly showed the Arabs the moon being split in half by Allah, but the unbelievers weren't convinced. The vast majority of Muslims believe the moon split around 620 AD, and only a very few who ignore the Hadith, and indeed all context, claim it will happen in the future. This is an incredible claim, since it would be the most significant astronomical event in human history, but it has very little evidence to back it up. Some say deep canyons on the moon, called rills, proved the moon split in half and was rejoined, but these are likely caused by lava tubes collapsing, erosion or tectonic activity. And besides, they aren't a clean groove across the middle, but rather a fractured spider web. Some say an Indian king witnessed it and converted, but he almost certainly wasn't even alive at the time. There is only one real source for the most significant astronomical event in human history, the Quran. The supposed miracle happened at night, and so either these areas saw it, or these areas. Yet there is nothing, no source, no evidence, no oral tradition handed down that supports this incredible claim. The astronomers of the Chinese, the Byzantines, the Sassanids, and the literate peoples of dozens of kingdoms did not record it. This can lead to only one conclusion. The splitting of the moon did not happen. 200 million people lived at the time, yet only one source attests to this incredible event. In conclusion, the Quran is not the perfect word of God, as Allah wouldn't make such a simple mistake. Therefore, Muslims should not believe in the perfect truth of the Quran.